Yep, you read that thumbnail correct, ladies and gentlemen. And no, it's not clickbait. I mean, I guess it kind of is clickbait. It's clickbait in the sense that I knew that it would get people to click on it because of like the kind of outrageous statement that it is, but it's what I personally believe. I actually asked this question in the middle of live stream on Twitch when we were listening to the Jid album for the first time. We were doing our live review as we do. If y'all guys don't follow on Twitch, second link in the description. Most definitely follow. New Music Fridays is lit every Friday. And if y'all guys want the full Jid review along with every other album review that we've done this year, consider subscribing on Patreon. All album reviews are uploaded in their entirety, raw form, to Patreon. The question that I asked in the middle of that JID review was like, I was listening and obviously mad impressed. And I was like, is JID a better rapper than someone like Kendrick Lamar? Is he better than Kendrick Lamar? A better rapper? And it's really not that crazy of a statement. If you really think about it, there are not too many rappers out there that I would put at a, di at a upper level rapping, like a upper echelon, anybody higher than JID in the current moment. And really the the asterisk on the on the clickbait and also the conversation in general, the big asterisk is I said that he is he a better rapper, not artist. I could honestly make the argument for artists as well. I don't even have Kung Fu Kenny's album in my top five of the year. You could argue that Kendrick's album was definitely more conceptualized and it's much more cohesive art experience. But as a listenable album, as something that I'm going to enjoy in the long term, I really haven't gone back to Kendrick's album too much, if I'm being honest, this year. I've already repeated Jid's album multiple times. But the real thing is that Jid is a better rapper, I personally believe, than not just Kendrick Lamar. Kendrick is just for the clickbait. I think he's a better rapper than literally every other rapper that's rapping right now. And of course, I'm going to get people that are like, why you got to compare them? Because I content bitch to get a conversation going obviously you can't compare things that are opinion based but we do regardless and the reason why i say jid is just like an overall better rapper than everybody is just the effortless nature in which he raps i honestly think that his schemes and his rapping might be better than current day eminem and i know that's gonna get a lot of that's gonna get a lot of hate for me saying that because i'm supposed to be a stan and all of that but i'm more of a stan of rap not just one artist like Eminem. And where I currently sit musically, I think that Jid is a more fluid rapper. When I'm listening to Eminem, when I'm listening to artists of that caliber that are going to go crazy with the rhyme schemes, it just doesn't seem as effortless. It doesn't seem as effortless of a flow as it does for Jid. Like, I can't even believe it sometimes. Normally, when it comes to that level of intricacy, whenever we're talking about rap, right? Whenever we're talking about internal rhyme schemes, A, B, A, A, B, A, C, B, B, C, like all these different rhyme patterns, normally it's going to sound forced. Not forced, but okay, he's making a statement by, by showing us that he can do this. And that's not just Eminem, that's every rapper in general. The only artist that I don't feel that way about is Jid. He is the only artist where I'm like, does this guy just talk and everything that he says rhymes at all times? Like, I have no problem following along with the storyline and the concept of whatever the song is supposed to be and listening to the rhyme schemes at the same time and the bars within the rhyme schemes. I can't even tell you a single corny bar or a bar that I would be like, ooh, that one didn't hit really. I can't tell you a single one for bar heavy rappers that are that are on the level of Jid. Like even now recording this video, I can't even think of them. Denzel's got bars, but he's, he's not, he's more of like a interest, I don't know, his most recent album, up there for album of the year for me is more like introspective it's not about necessarily the bars although he does have one of the harder bars this year when he said this game like home depot bitch it got keys hoes and hammers that shit was crazy when i heard it but yeah i mean there's like if we're t if we're talking about bar heavy rappers where wordplay is the entire name of the game for them all i could really think are eminem and Lil Wayne. eminem and Lil wayne are both from a prior generation of jid but they're active rappers currently and some of Eminem's bars, corny. I get that that's kind of like his like, oh, I'm just fucking around on the mic. I'm the goat at this shit. They're supposed to be corny. I get it, but it doesn't change the fact that some of the lines are too simple for me. Same thing with Lil Wayne. It's been my problem with Lil Wayne the entire time. Lil Wayne has always been so heavy with the bars that there's no way you're rapping with this many bars and you're not going to have some whack ones here and there. Not everything is going to go hard as latex, late text, late text. Not everything's going to be that hard at Wheezy F, baby. And the F is for phenomenal. 
How do we let that one slide as a community? But Jid's bars on the whole album, I don't think there was a single bar where I was like, ooh, that one didn't really hit. I honestly think that Jid might be the best active rapper in the game. Again, not the better artist necessarily, although I could make that argument because I have listened to Jid's album more times for the short amount of time that has been out then I have Kung Fu Kenny's entire because that's the one that people are going to compare in the rap circles we're going to say that that is one of the album of the year contenders but for me it just didn't do it the way that Jid's album did so to me if I'm talking about true MCing when it comes to rhyme scheme when it comes to flow when it comes to song structure, most of Jid's songs are two-parters on this most recent album. A whole breakdown and a whole another section of the song with its own flow entirely that's different from the first half. So when it comes to rhyme scheme, Jid stands above and beyond. When it comes to bars and, and lack of corny ones, Jid is up there. When it comes to album structure for the entire album, Jid is up there. When it comes to persona on the mic, Jid is up there. I don't think that there's anybody with a more complete package right now currently than Mr. J.I.D. If you have a different opinion, feel free to leave it in the comments. I do like doing these kind of debate type videos. So I do like reading through the comments of these type videos. If you like this type of video where we're talking more, I plan on doing more of these type of conversations where I'm either ranting or giving my opinion, not necessarily reacting all the time, just kind of giving my opinion on what I think certain topics or I'm also thinking about seeing some of the outlandish shit that's said on hip hop Twitter and bringing that shit over to YouTube and being like, okay, this person is obviously off their rocker. They're in Shutter Island because there's no way what they said is real in the real world. So I'm thinking about doing this more. I'm trying to like, trying to just switch it up. You know, we've been, we've been, we've been doing reactions for three years straight already. And that is like, like I just, I just need something. I need to inject something fresh into the channel. So I'm hoping that y'all guys like these kind of conversational videos. Let's get a little dialogue going. No, we don't have to compare everybody to everybody, but at the same time, we do. Rap is an extremely competitive space. There is no church in the wild. Everybody wants to be the best person. Everybody wants to be the alpha rapper. They want to go down as the greatest. That's why lists exist. If you have the mindset that we shouldn't be comparing rappers, then you must not be in the same mindset that your favorite rapper is in because your favorite rapper is trying to be the best when it comes to rapping against his peers. Hope y'all guys enjoyed this. We got a new mic. It's a little more chill of a vibe. But other than that, Appreciate y'all guys tuning in. Subscribe if you haven't. Support the Patreon and the Twitch. We do these kind of conversations live on Twitch. So consider supporting. But other than that, peace.